Good evening, everyone. I'll be talking about how we can boost our productivity using ChatGPT and ChatGPT's power tools. So let's start. So I hope we uh, all know what is ChatGPT. Uh, ChatGPT is a, a powerful language model uh, developed by OpenAI, and uh, ChatGPT power tools uh, are a set of extension add-ons. Uh, that can be used to improve the functionality of uh, ChatGPT. You all know that uh, productivity is a crucial uh, things in today's uh, fast paced work environment. Finding a way to enhance our uh, efficiency and uh, streamline our workflow can make a significant difference in our success. Uh, so let's start. So, our uh, first tool is uh, AI uh, PRM or Artificial Intelligence uh, Powered, Powered Response Manager. Uh, in a Chrome extension that uh, gives you access to thousands of free uh, engineered prompts uh, uh, that actually uh, specially designed for OpenAI uh, chat GDP tools. So uh, let's explore the dashboard of uh, these tools so you can understand the better. So if uh, if you are a, a ChatGTP user, uh, you will know that uh, sometimes it's uh, really hard to get the output you truly deserve. Uh, this is where the uh, AI uh, PRM uh, ChatGTP Chrome extension comes in. Uh, this AI add-on help user to access uh, 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 lots of uh, ready-made props. So you can see there are uh, thousands of uh prompts is there uh and uh, all of our free uh in this public tab there are uh some uh, uh, premium feature as well even uh the important things is uh, you can also create your own uh prompt template you can save it uh as a pub uh, public or uh private there is no issue so uh if i uh, give an example uh how uh, we can use the, uh, this uh, prompt template. So let's, uh, let's start it. So suppose uh, you are a student or you are a uh, English learner, you are trying to uh, improve your uh, English skill. Uh, so in this case, maybe uh, you are thinking you can uh, practice uh, uh, English language uh, with chat GPT. So in, in this way, it's really hard to uh, create a uh, proper, I mean, prompt. So uh, in uh, in that case, we can use uh, those kind of ready-made tools. Suppose uh, uh, I can, uh, select the output uh, that is uh, i want to learn this is english and okay uh, we can make this thing default uh, otherwise you can also think there are a few things uh, only one uh, tune are available that is emotional definitely we will not use it uh, but in the upgrade version there are more tools and more uh, writing style uh, currently we will use our actually default uh, configuration as we are using the free version of these tools and uh, you can set uh, your rule over here. Uh, suppose uh, I'm setting uh, my rule as a freelancer. And chat GPT rules, uh, I'm uh, making it like client. OK. And now uh, we can set the title of uh, the, uh, I mean, conversation. What type of conversation we want? Okay, so we can new, uh, fo follow this placeholder. Okay, so first uh, we will uh, set the uh, title of dialogue and then we will set the target language. So, uh, so our target language is English and just uh, for testing purpose i am uh, uh, i will uh, start a conversation with client about a new project okay so it is uh, processing
Okay, so you can see uh, there is a conversation already started. Client say me hi, uh, how uh, how are you today? So I can say hi. Yeah, so clients say, oh, I'm glad uh, uh, to hear that you are also fine. How can we help you? So in the in that way, we can continue our uh, English conversation. So in uh, client, uh, uh, chat GTP play a role as a client and I can play a role as a uh, freelancer. And after the end of the conversation, uh, chat GTP also give, uh, uh, will provide a score uh, how was uh, our conversation where I can improve uh, my English uh, conversation. So uh, uh, this is uh, really help you to uh, make you uh, perfect on the, uh, I mean, uh, English skill. So in that uh, the same way, there are uh, lots of template, like if you are a uh, uh, developer uh, and if you want to test your uh, code, then you can uh, search the test code, sorry, code. Then you can generate a new code. You can refactor uh, the uh, existing code. Also, there are, uh, uh, also there are uh, some topics. Uh, you can set uh, those, uh, uh, you can select the topics if you are a, a digital marketer you can select a seo and you can see there are lots of properties there that will help uh, seo best practice so uh, this is really uh, helpful tools uh, to uh, give you uh, lots of uh, perfect prompts okay so let's start again our uh, slide so our uh, second uh, uh, tools is uh, web uh, chat api so we all know that uh, chat gtp is uh, the uh, result is not up to date since uh, chat gtp uh, has been updated or uh, feed information since 2021 so uh, you might run into a few uh, root blocks uh, most commonly chat gtp will explain you uh, to that it is does not know anything past certain date uh, with these uh, web chat API, uh, web uh, chat GPT, you can add relevant web results to your prompts so that the answer generated uh, are more accurate and updated. So if I see these uh, tools, uh, I have already installed these tools, and I hope you can see there is a, a additional uh, I mean toolbar. Uh, this actually comes for uh, these tools. So if I open, uh, if I enable the web access, and if I search anything on chat, uh, chat GPT, it will actually give us the updated result. Even there are uh, some uh, advanced feature, like if you uh, want to uh, extract any information from any particular uh, URL, suppose this is a, I mean, blog post. So if I want to summarize this, post or if I want to uh, find any information uh, within this boost, I can just uh, I can just uh, add this page and I can test the link and I can uh, give the instruction summarize. And uh, it will give us a summary of these uh, blog. Yeah. See, the result is uh, there. So we can see the summary of these uh, blog post. Even if you want to more uh, short answer, we can again uh, uh, tell uh, then uh, we need to make it short. Uh, in that way, uh, you can see there is a site. So you, in, in this feature, you can add any particular site address, and you, you can uh, ask the GDP what you need, uh, what you need uh, to find uh, on on in this uh, website. So it it will help actually. So uh, okay, 
let's go to our third power tools okay so third power tools is uh, maxi this is my most uh, fami uh, I mean, uh, favorite uh, power tools uh, that i use actually every day so uh, max uh, maxi is a chrome extension that actually bring uh, ai power tools to any website with uh, one click you can compose uh, summarize fix spelling grammar or translate uh, anything uh, with this uh, maxi so if i uh, like uh, in the previous tools i uh, just show that uh, we can uh, summarize anything for any particular uh, i mean uh, page so but if you want to summarize anything like uh, this section i don't want to read the whole things but i want to summarize as only these things so in this case you just need to select uh, and then there will be a pop up uh, appear and if you click on it you can see there are lots of prompts is there so you just click summarize they will show the summary of these uh, particular section see this is really awesome okay so if you are uh, like uh, there is an email i have just uh, make it open so if you want to reply uh, this email very quickly but uh, there are not much time to review it so you can just select the email and click on it and just select the reply button make a reply so reply this uh, we can set the tone there is a tune actually uh, am i uh, willing it or dislike it so i am uh, selecting it like so it will give us a positive uh, reply so yeah see uh, it's a, okay if i click continue maybe it will show the more details yeah so in this way we can save our time actually and boost our productivity uh, with uh, using this kind of tools and there are lots of uh, things actually they are only not uh, these things so if you uh, open it you can see there are lots of things uh, pre-built there uh, fix spelling grammar make shorter make longer also if you want to add your custom uh, prompts so you can uh, add it uh, there are uh, feature you can uh, add it also uh, like if you are uh, a blogger if, if, uh, if you want to write anything uh, like a blog post or outline or brainstorm idea you can just open uh, i mean right click then uh, you can see the max ai uh, options uh, when you click there will be a sidebar open and in the sidebar you can uh, easily generate uh, these kind of things uh, so let's start uh, let's go to our next next one the fourth power tools so this is a uh, chat gtp from uh, chrome and youtube summary so sometimes uh, uh, we sometimes uh, we uh, we show uh, some videos that are actually uh, very long but we need to just uh, just uh, we need to just uh, want to summary what actually uh, happened so in this uh, case we can use these tools uh, th that in uh, these tools actually give us uh, the i mean whole summary if you uh, click on the uh, summary button then uh, it will uh, give us all the conversation in a text way and we can make it su summarize easily also when you will install these tools uh, one option will be there on the uh, i mean uh, top bar so in this feature you can directly access your uh, chat gtp uh, dashboard uh, so it will also help you uh, uh, to be more productive you don't need to go uh, again and again on the chat gtp uh, main portal you can directly open the dashboard uh, on this pop-up and you can ask directly uh, uh, whatever you want to do uh, in chat gtp okay so go to the next tools so this is uh, not a tool actually like uh, extension 
but this uh, forefront AI is a portal. So if you uh, want to use ChatGPT uh, version four, so uh, this is not actually available uh, for uh, free user. This is uh, for premium. So if you want to uh, exclude the ChatGPT uh, four, you can use this forefront AI. Also, uh, in this forefront AI, there are uh, lots of things actually, uh, like uh, if you want to personalize. Uh, response you can uh, select uh, the person uh, is it a software engineer or marketing manager or uh, i mean uh, system engineer there are lots of uh, person is there so you can select otherwise we can make it uh, default also the interesting things that that is not only the uh, chat gtp even you can uh, generate uh, any image also in this uh, chat gtp uh, in this uh, forefront ai like uh, if I if I want to uh, generate any image, so uh, I just to I just need to select the image hashtag, and I need to uh, uh, send the prompt what I need. Like uh, yeah. Yeah. so uh, you'll see uh, it's generating. Yeah, see, uh, it's uh, generating uh, a red cat as per our uh, prompt. So in the in that way, you uh, who, who is actually uh, regularly using the mid journey, you know that mid journey currently not available uh, for free user. Uh, it's completely premium. So in uh, in the uh, in the the time you can use the forefront AI. Uh, instead of mid journey also uh, there are other uh, ai option you can explore the things actually uh, on the uh, forefront ai yeah uh, that's it uh, so thank you everyone